Okay, so let's have a closure Clifford on equation, but this time you're asked for the heat of vaporization. So you're asked to calculate the heat of vaporization for ethanol given the vapor pressure of 40 degrees Celsius of 150 torr and the normal boiling point for ethanol 78 degrees Celsius. So that means you need to get the P here and at normal boiling point, it's 760 torr. And the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to convert this to Kelvin. So we can have this as 313 Kelvin and this is equals to 351 Kelvin. So now we have that, okay, we can look at the formula, L and P1 over P2, heat of vaporization, okay, R, and then one over T2 minus one over T1. And then we substitute with the value that we have here. So we have 150 over 760, okay? And the one that we're looking for here, this is 8.314 joules K mole. And this is equals to 1, 351 minus 1 over 313. Now, this value will give you a negative value because this is smaller compared to this one. And that is around 3.459 times 10 to the negative 4. And you multiply it with heat of vaporization over 8.314 value and this one if you're going to do this 150 over 760 that will give you get the ln that's negative 1.623 so if you're going to have this value here so this now become 4.16 times 10 to the negative 5 delta h of vaporization equals to this so you divide both sides by negative 4.16 times 10 to the negative 5 giving you a heat of vaporization around 3.9 times 10 to the 4 joules, okay? Or if you're going to do this one, that is equals to how many kilojoules? 39 kilojoules per mole. Okay.